In this video, I'm going to be discussing how to replace the AC pressure switch on a 2002 to 2004 Ford Focus. This is the SVT model, but it should be the same for any Focus from year 2002 to 2004, um, probably also 1998 all the way to 2007, but don't quote me on that. Uh, so the symptoms I was having was I would turn the AC on inside the car and nothing would happen. Uh, basically, the light would come on that says the AC was on, but couldn't actually feel any AC. Uh, when I would turn the car itself on, I would find that the AC compressor down here would not be spinning. Um, so anyway... <clears throat> I had determined that it was the AC pressure switch. So first of all, the switch itself is actually located down right here. It's kind of hard to see. So you can see the right beside the firewall kind of behind the strut tower. Um, so you can, there's other videos that show how to check if this is actually bad. Um, basically, all you do is you pull the connector off and then jump the two wires to see if your con if your compressor will then turn on. Um, so here, here's the switch itself. Um, you'll see it's a two-prong switch. Um, they're pretty simple, not a whole lot going on. There is, a I think, a Schrader valve on the inside, and it's a hex. Um, so anyway, so this is the old one. So... All you do is just grab a wrench, uh, 11 sixteenths will work, and just get down in there and unscrew the AC pressure switch. Um, and like I said, it's it's got a valve in it, so you don't have to worry about losing Freon or anything. Uh, but yeah, so you just, all you gotta do is unscrew it, pull it out, put your new one in, then hook your sensor back up. So it's pretty simple. Um, so yeah. There was no video on it that I could tell, so I just figured I would make the video for that. Um, but anyway, until next time, take care.